so here is a demo starting from scratch and building a few smart materials. So I'll start by grabbing the smart shader. And then I can browse a few textures. And I will already blend them with the texture mixer. So I can use the height to blend them with the, their displacement. I will use the box mapping utility and use the facing mask to blend the two texture sets. Just don't forget to set the material in displacement only instead of bump by default. And you can adjust the scale. You can control shift click your mask to preview it and add a bit of noise. You can control the strength of the displacement in the smart shader, adjusting the scale and also the mid level if you want to push it outward or inward the mesh. You can add a mask mixer if you want to add a paint override or other smart masks. You can add a smart brightness and contrast if you want to control anything, for example here the height, to make it more flat. And you can control each texture color at the bottom of the texture mixer. For the water, I can use directly one of the smart materials. Any slider can go to infinite values, you just have to type it. Here for the ruins, I will drop a new texture and smart shader, setting the mapping to box and the scale in world space. Correcting the color already to blend a bit better in the environment setting the material in displacement only and then for a mossy effect I will directly use a smart effect then I can activate the paint override so filling everything in black first so it doesn't affect the smart masks and then painting in green some areas where I want to force the moss effect and in red some areas where I don't want moss Just adding a shadow caster to have some nicer cloud shadows. And adding a little bit of anti-tiling so the repeating patterns of the textures are less visible. Testing some different HDRI. And I think that's it for this quick demo of starting from a blank scene to a scene with a few smart materials.